Good morning. Again, this is your friend and pastor, Carlo Lord, coming to you from the First Baptist Church of Paraiso, Panama, Republic of Panama. I want to draw your attention this morning to 1 Samuel, the 15th chapter, verse 22. That's the uh, 1 Samuel, the 15th chapter, and verse 22 reads as follows. And Samuel said, had the Lord has great delight in burnt offering and sacrifices, as in obeying the voice of the Lord? Behold, to obey is better than sacrifice, and to hearken than the fat of rams, the word of God. Seeing you have purified your souls in obeying the truth, through the Spirit unto unfeigned love of the brethren. See that you love one another with a pure heart fervently, being born again not of corruptible seed, but of incorruptible by the word of God which liveth and abideth forever. That that's taken from 1 Peter chapter 1 verses 22 and 23. As Christian, we are asked to fulfill the law by loving one another. God called us to act on obedience, not conscience, and we are called to this action not for reward but for the sake of fulfillment. For in the fulfillment of providence, we are given life, which is a gift beyond, way, way beyond reward. My friends, are you obeying the voice of God? In Philemon, in, in Philemon we read, this is what we read. In Philemon chapter uh, verse 21, I'm sorry, chapter 1 verse 21, we read, Having confidence in thy obedience, I wrote unto thee, knowing that thou wilt also do more than I say. My friends, it's much more better to obey the voice of God than the voice of man. Let me ask you, which are you obeying today? I trust that as followers of Jesus, as believers, as Christians, as children of God, we are following and listening to the voice of God and not of man. My friends, God bless you. Have a pleasant day in the Lord. Until then, God be with you. Have a blessed day.